Hey guys. <clears throat> I need to get something in my system. Um, in my system, what? In my body, in my stomach. And the only thing that we really have right now is pizza. I'm just a girl over here trying to get my life together. You know what I'm saying? I really don't want to eat. Like I don't, but I haven't eaten today at all. I wait as long as possible before I eat. When I first wake up, I'm not gonna eat for probably four or five hours. I just don't, I don't feel hungry. I usually don't eat for like hours. I haven't eaten anything besides Cheerios. Well, I didn't eat anything yesterday, obviously. I'm gonna try to get something down today. I'm gonna just do something small. And I'm honestly not even hungry right now. I only had two meals today. They were both pretty hefty. I did not like eating when I first wake up. Yesterday, I actually only ate once, which is kind of bad. This is my first meal. Me and my girlfriend are cutting this in half, so I'm not eating that whole thing, so don't worry. Yeah, this is an apple crisp that I just couldn't finish. I'm gonna eat a little chip. I told myself I wasn't gonna have any chips, but a little baby. And what I do is I just put a light amount of mayonnaise, just very light amount. And the only reason why I'm eating three pieces is because I did not eat all day and I literally feel like I probably won't eat much later. This video is so raw, you guys. Fuck. So we decided to go to Starbucks. I just got like a 60 calorie tea. Oh yeah, that's healthy. <laughs> but 90% of the time I am making healthier choices. This is honestly the best choice I could have made. Only one fat. I don't know if I want to eat this because I kind of want to balance it out and I have already a meal prepped and healthy. Sugars is only six. And I don't know, maybe I'll choose something health healthy at the cheesecake factory. I don't know. Apples to me taste like candy now. I do prefer ground turkey, so that is an issue. All of the sugar is purely just from exactly like it says, pure fruit. It's all sugar from fruits. Um. I do want you guys to know that I'm the queen of like moderation. I lost 89 pounds before. Um, I was eating whatever I wanted, just less. Her sister has a lot of like dessert type things for today. That's gonna be like what we're eating on today. So I definitely wanna get some like protein or something. <laughs> Ooh, your girl's full. So that is a lot of fucking food right there. And that's even if I finish the whole thing. Oh yeah. This is super loose, comfortable fitting. For me, I feel like I could have went with a five. Lately, I've been loving just like raw vegetables. This video is so raw, you guys. Fuck. The broccoli is the best part. And there's only like four pieces. I love broccoli. I only did want to eat celery. And if I sat here and ate carrots and stuff, I'd get full so fast and probably only eat like 100 calories. My tummy hurts because we haven't ate. Yeah. Filling myself with nothing but veggies, fruits, and just plain chicken. I don't see an issue with some diet freaking soda. Oh god, here I go have another small chip. I don't use oil to cook. No oil. Uh, I actually use water, which is a healthier alternative. I don't use butters. I didn't use butter, didn't use oil. I just used water. And all this down here is water, because I don't use oil. I wanted to use oil, but I decided not to. I'm just gonna add a little bit, because... I don't want it with butter. I don't want it with brown sugar. That's not what I want. That's not healthy. Instead of adding more Pam, I add water. Little uh, potato company, they're like little potatoes. And we use some butter on the potatoes. And then we, we had to use a little bit of butter in the potatoes, but we use a light butter. In five days, losing 15.2 pounds. For some people, they're gonna be like, that's super unhealthy, but I had a lot of water weight I was holding on to. My heart rate's at 71. And I stood up. I want to say the majority of people think I should not join a gym. 
You don't need a gym membership to get a workout. All you need is two legs, two feet, two arms. Even then, you don't even need that. She doesn't understand nutrition like I do. I know how to lose weight. I have the knowledge. I know what's healthy versus not. Your calorie, like that was low calories, like the banana and the macchiato, but you need to eat more, I feel like, substance when you first wake up. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, have you ever tried like avocado toast? Like a fat girl teaching a nutrition class, like it would never happen, but I have the knowledge. Each meal is 600 calories. About 160, 180 calories. Breakfast, 600. Lunch, 600. Dinner, dinner, 600. Spinach is nothing. It's like five calories. In between breakfast and lunch, I have a protein bar or protein shake. In between lunch and dinner, I have a protein bar or protein shake. 90 calories per serving. Because I have to eat to survive. I use about half a serving of balsamic vinaigrette, which the kind that I'm using, that's about 50 calories. This was three points. So I'm gonna get a sirloin, which is 250 calories because it's only six ounces. My calories were pretty high with both meals, but I'm okay with that. Two servings of corn, two servings of green beans. So for one serving of green beans is 20, so that's 40 since there's two servings. Green beans were zero points, salsa was zero points. I'm gonna get my two sides, which is gonna be green beans, only 100 calories. 60 calories per serving of corn. So two uh, servings of corn, which is 160. So that fit in my calories. And it's only 100 calories, and my calories are at 1750. So, and then mashed potatoes, so freaking good. No gravy, 220 calories. All of this is very, very low calorie. And the baked potato was eight points. And there's 4.5 servings in this whole thing. Um, 60 calories left that I'm not gonna be eating. Oh, and just thinking about eating 600 calories for breakfast right now is just not fun to me. So 90 times 4.5, we can do the math later, but it's not that many calories. Um, I'm drinking water, plain water, no flavoring. This is like the best I've done in a while, 2000 calories, not shabby. Um, it's been pretty easy. So yeah, I'm not gonna be going over calories. I'm staying under my calories, don't you worry. So right here I just have some plain water, three pieces of pizza, plus what I plan on eating later fits into my calories. And I was able to stay under my calories and the next day I was down about, I think it was like 2.6 pounds. So I love that you can lose weight eating whatever you want as long as you're under your calories. Okay, this is just plain water. You can lose weight and eat pizza. But I'm gonna stay around 150, 100 to 150 carbs, which I feel like is gonna be kinda hard to get that high. This video is so raw, you guys, fuck. And on Mother's Day, I was looking, I should have vlogged it, I was looking so good. God, I'm not even trying to be conceited. I'm actually kind of surprised with how tight this is because it is a six. But if you're trying to buy this, the size does run kind of small. <laughs> wow. I look. Enough talking about calories. Lately, I've been very numb towards my weight, but today I felt sad ashamed and i almost like i have these feelings of like am i ever gonna change a lot of people think i'm gaining weight for some weird reason i don't know what it is and i look in the mirror and i'm like i don't recognize this person at all amberlynn stop stop binging stop overeating so crazily stop being such a freaking food addict and or if there is a rock bottom, I want this to be it. I want this to be it. I'm doing Weight Watchers again, <laughs> so we're doing it together. That's really all that it is to it.
<laughs> hey, I don't know if you'll read this, but I watched your Smash or Pass video and liked it. I read the comments and did not like those at all. Just want to let you know, I think you're stunning. I'd totally smash, lol. To put it less vulgar, I guess. Those people don't know what the F they're talking about. You really are gorgeous, okay? If I'd just seen you out somewhere, I'd really want to just go up to you and ho uh, and hope you were gay <laughs> and try to flirt. Not good at the whole flirting thing. I haven't been in a relationship in nine months, so I'm super rusty. But anyway, those are probably just jealous that you're hot and they're not. 